Welcome everyone, I hope you're having a good time on the markets. It is Ethereum today on the topic. With a minus 1.46 for the past 24 hours, we're gonna take care about the situation out there from the charts. Scramble here as usually from emotional crypto trading, talk about in the most rational way possible around the markets, especially data of the space. So the global crypto market cap is actually having a downtrending movement. And this is about to get very, very close to an end, which means a bounce back is looking forward to happen. Therefore, Ethereum is preparing for that. We're going to discover more into the charts. But before that, make sure to check out the channel we have with other videos related to ChatGPT bot trading and live trades and all that stuff. So if you want to join us, make sure to check that out, including our trading report with our ChatGPT bot trading with the weekly performance as well, the way you can participate if you think this movement is fine for you. There's option without any prior fee, only commission from the profits achieved where the trading goes to API. So you can check this, but I actually talk about it at the end of the video. So let's see what's happening on the Ethereum charts. And we're looking at the two hours candlesticks. The first thing that I would like to underline is the fact that we were having a very, very strong uptrending channel. And this is appearing between the two green lines that are moving in parallel situation. And this is allowing us to construct steadily for Ethereum till we broke out at the top. Now that breakout at the top usually means acceleration and it's good for day trading. But at the same time, uh, it creates a dangerous moment due to the fact that in such situation, there are swing traders and position traders exiting. So the exiting creates selling pressure. The exiting out of longs is actually generating selling pressure on the market. And that is punishing the price in other words. So breakouts in an uptrending channel of the resistance is not that welcome. That acceleration you have is something that I generally, for a steady increase moment, I don't prefer. I most likely enjoy to see and stick in the channel to go like that forever, instead of trying to accelerate, but then you're gonna catch a lot of the people exiting because of the risks involved. And on top of that, they did make good amounts of money with their trades since January and February, the ones that are doing swings like that in positions. So at the top here, we had a strong resistance coming from the Fibonacci blue line. And that was extremely powerful. At the same time, we're sticking above the trending line resistance that transformed into a quick support out there forming a triangle here at the top. We broke below. We did broke below quite quickly and aggressively. And we started a correction wave of ABC, which is about to get completed. Now, the idea around the C final movement is to keep it under a ranging market here with a potential little low grabbing which means that it is not an issue if you go below 1824 right now below the sea level a little bit a little bit means that you don't want to get more than 2.5 percent below this due to the fact that you open up the door for a different discussion with a domination towards downside from that level. Whatever is up to 2.5 from the current low can be a fake out, which is most likely what is gonna happen. If we get a range here, markets will take the liquidity from the below at a time they start thinking about pushing back to the high levels. From the way BTC and Ethereum looks like, there is a lot of the room above the current levels, including above the previous tops. So we're actually talking about Ethereum's level around 2200, 2280. There is room for that. There is a golden pocket as well waiting here for us uh, in between the two yellow lines. And I'd like to share with you the buying and selling pressure indicator at the bottom. With the fact that at the time we have pushed here with a selling pressure on the index number 17.88. Every time you get that high, it's very hard basically to sort of a way establish a new high on the selling pressure. 
whatever selling pressure we might get right now, if it builds like that, is going to create a very, very nice divergence. And the divergence in that case scenario, if we get it, will be a clear signal of market reversal, which also correlates with my discussion of a up to 2.5 decrease below the current low which will actually build that little top here in the selling pressure indicator. However, that is one situation and variable on the table. Meanwhile, it is not a necessity and is not one of a kind with high probability. The one with a high probability will be a strong range here that will drive a lot of the crazy, a lot of the traders going crazy. So be very careful these days. Now, what else is on the table? nothing special folks everything you see above us any line is representing strong resistance let's get that range going on here let's get a little accumulation and then getting back to the red line of fibonacci and then the blue line of fibonacci i would like to get established above those levels and we definitely need to retest basically the highs we made here in the buying pressure somewhere around 19.65 index on that specific movement it is quite easy right now that we have been losing the selling pressure as you can see energy it is no longer in the highs here like it used to be there take a look at that we have lost it it's downtrending meanwhile the price is no longer pumping extremely hard but we have lost the energy of the bears at this level i mean correction is there and it's not little if you want me to verify it's 15% in five days. That's not little. We have not received a 170% movement on the Ethereum or a 70% movement on the Ethereum in a couple of days. It's none of that crazy bull market movements that we used to have in a macro perspective. By the way, it's just about a year and we're going to have the BTC halving. So think about that one as well. In one year, BTC halving is appearing. Every bull market starts from that point and that bull market is about for two years during that two years people with ten thousand dollars can get to one million dollars in trading be very careful about what's going to happen and consider it as a serious situation for your chances that's all for the moment in this video guys subscribe if you'd like to see more like the video at the same time and if you care about joining our bot trading movement and if you would like to do uh, to be part of it, no prior fee, only commission from our performance and pure profits achieved. Trading goes through API permission, extremely simple. Make sure to complete the form to join and contact me. All the links can be discovered in the description area or comments area. And at the same time, I would like to talk about coaching. So feel free to watch this video till the end for those of you that care about education, would like to become traders, or you want to improve yourself. Just watch this till the end. At the same time, if you would like to change the results of your performance, if you want to do day trading, swing trading, position trading as a full-time or part-time trader, I do have a one-on-one -on -one coaching directly with me where I'll take you by hand between four to six weeks and teach you in an intensive way how to do the whole process. This is starting from the fundamentals of the mindset mentality going towards the technical analysis where the idea is to understand the language of the market and react to that language accordingly. It's quite simple. If you know what does the market tells you, you know how to react to that. It is a message. It tells you this is where I'd like to go. This is where I have total domination, which is why you need to encrypt the language of the market, of the market perfectly in order to act um, act correctly like if you're not correct in trading if you're not accurate you're not going to make money on the long term now live trades are also part of the process uh day trades swing trades technicals homework i'm sharing with you my screen and taking you through the whole process if you want to be on a call for this one as well just register now and you can qualify for a free conversation if you think it's interesting you can read more about it and discover more. Have a good time, guys. Subscribe, and we'll talk to you soon.